I'm Amy Allison, live from the Oracle, Oracle Arena in Oakland, California. The events in D.C., which are on the big screen here, are just beginning to celebrate the inauguration of Barack Obama's 44th president. The United States, serve, protect, and defend the Constitution of the United States. So help you God. And we're going to go to the floor and just check in with Sebastian Kuntz, who is in the middle of the thick of things. Sebastian, what's it look like? Hi, Amy. i got to tell you, I'm over here, way over at the east entrance, and the people, it's not showing any signs of letting up here at the turnstiles. I don't know if you can hear behind me. There's, It just keeps coming and coming, and waves of people keep coming and coming. And, uh, you know, they're, they've got their tickets. It's sort of the... The, it's the the feeling of a, a sporting event. Everybody's got their ticket, looking for the right section, seeing if they can go in this door or that. But, you know, there's also lots of stuff to buy. You can buy a $3 bottle of Barack Obama Inauguration Day water. Uh, but it's okay, because the $3 goes to New Beginnings, which is the partnership to benefit the youth of Alameda County. It's sort of a job development group. You know? I want to briefly go down to Sebastian Kuntz, who's on the floor in the Oracle Arena. With about 10,000 people have gathered to, to be together to watch this inauguration. I think the number might even be bigger than that. I really have a feeling that people sort of showed up and sort of just decided they were going to buy tickets this morning. The energy here a second ago when they announced, ladies and gentlemen, Barack Obama was... I mean, it was beyond anything that the, the Golden State Warriors, who play basketball at the it's arena, that's beyond anything they've ever seen, I guarantee you. is the, the biggest energy, the most uh, spectacular. It was as if Barack Obama walked into their row here at Oracle Arena. That's incredible. It really is. I've never seen or heard anything like it. Tell me who you've talked to and met this morning uh, that I, have come to be here in this event. I've been speaking to as many people as I can, kids uh, who are here with their classes, uh, you know, who, the, the girls who got the, the extra good grades and got to come because they're on the honor roll. Some people who just drove up from Stockton this morning. Now, they were in line outside like at 7 a.m. That means to have left Stockton probably at like 5.30 in order to have gotten here to get in line that early. People are absolutely committed to, to being here and, and just sort of being able to, I think, tell their kids and their grandkids many, many years from now that, yeah, I was a part of the Barack Obama inauguration event on January the 20th, 2009. So exciting. And tell me a little bit about what the scene is there. There's some large screens there that people are watching. It's Yeah, if you've ever seen a basketball game, it's, it's sort of, they got the jumbotron. I've been, known, I've been known to see a Warriors game or two there, Sebastian. <laughs> There's, you know, a, a four-sided jumbotron in the center of the arena, sort of right over the, the basketball court, and then there's uh, large screens placed around the, the perimeter of the, the sort of arena, above where the seats, the seats that are opposite you across the arena. You can look up and see the scoreboard if it were a game. In this case, you're seeing the Jumbotron with, again, that mass of people you described. Two million people on, on the, the mall there in Washington, D.C., and uh, the people here feeling like they're just a, as much a part of the party as anybody who's in Washington today. That's pretty amazing. It's amazing. So we'll come back to you in a few minutes. You okay. can uh, keep us up Update about what's happening inside of the Oracle Arena. This Absolutely. is Green 960 online and radios.